Hello, Kevin with Water Monster here. And in today's video, we're gonna discuss our optional water filter kit. Our filter kit helps ensure clean drinking water for your participants and visually gives peace of mind to the general public. Your kit includes a carbon filter that captures particles down to two microns in size. It also comes with a short connecting hose. Your filter is designed to connect directly to a common garden hose thread. However, we always recommend that you use a food grade drinking water hose. And a food grade hose is distinguished by either a white hose or a blue hose. And you'll always find an NSF stamp. NSF is what you're looking for. That ensures food grade safe. Now we do offer these hoses on our website. To set up your water filter, remove the top cap and the bottom cap from the filter and go ahead and orient it so that the water flow arrow is pointing up. Now take your short hose and screw it into the top. And then in this example, we have our water source hose sitting right here, but normally it would be stretched out, hooked up to a water faucet on the side of the building most likely. Take the mail into the hose and screw it into the bottom of the filter. And once you've got that secured, now you're ready to hook it up to your water monster tank. So to connect the filter to the water monster tank, first take the female to female swivel that came with your water monster tank. This is an integral part right here. And go ahead and screw it on. And then you're gonna screw the top hose of the filter to the bottom of the swivel. And then the swivel here, you'll, it typically takes two hands and they, and they swivel in opposite directions to tighten to the hose bib here. And then the other way to tighten the hose here and get them good and snug. Now from here, turn on your water source, the water will flow up, and you have this ball valve here to control the water flow into the tank. This is the on position, and this is off. You can turn it partial way if you want to partial or slow down the fill rate, uh, but typically wide open takes 10 to 15 minutes to fill. Now you've got clean drinking water, and you're ready to serve. So when filling your water monster tank, we always advise to use municipal tap water or another safe known source of water. This filter is not designed to clean non-potable water. So if you're concerned about your water source, we recommend having your local water district test a sample for peace of mind and safety. One of the most common questions I get asked all the time is, how long will my filter last? Well, as long as you're using municipal tap water, it should last for several thousand gallons of water and a period of time of three to six months. But what I've learned, you know, most of our customers, they operate on a seasonal basis like camps and schools and municipalities. So what I suggest is use the filter for a season. And once the season is over with, discard it and next year start with a fresh filter. So I hope this video has been helpful. And as always, if you have any questions, you can contact me directly. Thank you.